can't believe we made it this far in the semester. You're telling me. It went by so fast. And tomorrow is the big night. Are you nervous? <laughs> nah. Me neither. Terrified. Oh my god, okay, me too. Yeah. <sighs> <sighs> well, at least we have this party to just relax. We can get rid of the pregame jitters. Yeah, but I think some of us are having a little too much fun. <laughs> They say you and I get out here to have some real fun, huh? That's real cute, but I don't think your idea of fun is the same as mine. What? We could find a middle ground. Come on. You just call me cute. I didn't say you were cute. I said your idea was cute. Just because you're the oldest guy here doesn't mean you can get with me. Nice try, though. Why don't you join your friends over there and go do something productive? They're not my type of people, though. But you. <laughs> So did you hear? Ben asked that weird girl at prom. What? You mean Colette? That's uh, interesting. Interesting? I'll tell you what's interesting. Last week, my sister somehow miraculously bought designer shoes. I think the word you're looking for is weird. Do you think that he likes her? Nah, I don't think so. I heard it was a dare. Or maybe he got blackmailed or something, but either way, she turned him down. Lucky him. Hmm. Wow. Who would decline an invitation from him? I mean, he's he's so hot, but I've... He barely notices any of us. I know, right? But she's so weird. Like, should it surprise any of us that she would turn him down? I don't think she's that weird. J just quiet. Yeah, I've never heard her say a thing. You know, I'm kind of surprised she's even stayed in this class for this long. Hey, girl can dance. You gotta give her that. Come on guys, gather around. It's time to spice this party up. Tell some ghost stories. Could be fun. Alright. Okay guys, I'll go first. There was once this girl, and she could sing super, super good. And her friend videotaped her and put it on YouTube. And then one day, she went out and she fell down a pair of steps. And then she had to have surgery in her throat. She woke up from that, and she could never sing again. <sighs> That's not scary. That's just depressing. Give me that. The other day, my mom and I pulled into the parking lot of a grocery store. She ran in to pick up a few things real quick. It was a late evening. No one was around. Really dark. Windows rolled up. All of a sudden, over my left shoulder, I heard what sounded like a man whispering my name in my left ear, as if it was his last breath of air. It sent chills down my spine. And then I slowly turned to look, but there was nothing there. <laughs> Ooh, creepy, but not that scary. I, I have a story. <gasps> uh, okay, here. Thank you. There is once a ballerina. Some could call her the black swan of the group because she was constantly ridiculed. Sure, she was weird, but she was very talented. Unfortunately, she was bullied and became an outcast. Falling into a depression because she was not considered good enough for anyone just because her style was slightly different. She took her life right above this stage. And everyone swept the incident like nothing happened. The curtains closed on her life, and they tried to wipe the memory of her existence from theirs. She didn't belong to begin with, they said. Now she's believed to roam this auditorium at night taking the souls of those who ridicule others and erasing their memory from the people who know them so they know what it feels like. Okay, I think we can all agree that Colette's story is the creepiest. <laughs> Let's turn on the lights. <laughs> well, uh, it's getting kind of late. Um, we should probably leave. Yeah, yeah, I agree. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Okay, 
gather around everyone. Just wanted to say, great job this performance and great job this semester. Uh, now we can finish this up. All you have to do is take your vows and you're free to leave. Um, wait, what about Colette's performance? Who? Colette. You know, she's the quiet girl that's been in our class all semester. Um, I know her attendance wasn't that great, but geez, she was still there. Yeah, how can you miss her? She's the only oddball who dresses differently from the rest of us. Yeah, she joined our circle last night and she told like the creepiest story. I'm sorry guys, I don't seem to have anyone like that what? by that name on my roster. Must have been a crazy party you guys had last night. That was weird.